yeah, delighted to be to be um, into the next round, if you like, um, against Hibs. Job done. I thought first half we played some really good football. Got in some great areas. Their keepers had two or three good saves. You know, they score with the, probably the first effort on goal. Good goal from their point of view. But I think there have been a lot of doubters out there at half-time. Um, certainly, maybe, maybe a few in the stadium, but certainly um, across the country, thinking, oh, this old Rangers team will bottle it again. And So I was delighted... Um, and we said to them at half-time, keep playing your football, you'll get opportunities. You know, we, we've got a team in there that can create. Um, uh, there was times today we picked the wrong choice, the wrong pass, or didn't get shot off early enough. Uh, but when we needed to defend at the end, you know, listen, the Queens have got nothing to lose. Last 10 minutes they can, you know, throw people forward. Um, and they did that. But you know, we stuck together and we, we got what we wanted. Was that one of the most stressful, mm -hmm. most nervy games that you ever managed? Yeah, definitely so. Um, you know, we talked about the first goal. And I don't think, you know, as I said before, I think first goal to them was huge. If we'd have got it, I think it'd have killed the tie. Um, but I still believed that if they got it, then we could go um, and still still get through. You know, I actually said to the lads before, we don't like to talk about negatives, but I think the last time they scored... The last game here, they scored first, and we ended up beating four two. So there was always belief that, regardless, you know, if if they went ahead, that we would create opportunities and, you know, we'd get a goal. So it was stressful, especially last, you know, ten fifteen minutes. Um, but you know, the keepers made a fantastic save from Kenny Miller's header. We've had other opportunities where we've picked the wrong pass. We could have made it easier for ourselves, um, but we did what we we set out to do, and that's through get through to playing Hibs. I don't imagine that you imagined that Harris Fuckett should be making the difference at the defensive end of things, but he cleared off the line to kind of save the tie in the end. He certainly did, and you know we talk about Harris because he's, you know, obviously he's a, a, a big lad, but he's not great at picking people up. But what he does, he goes in the hole for corners, and he knows he's got to get back in there on the goal line. You know, once it's gone over his head, and he did that. And from me, all I can see the ball. It's a great effort from the lad. It's gone over Cammy, and next minute Harris's big head popped up and headed it off the line. So we were delighted with him. Um, and again, I thought we got him in the good areas at Park today. He's had a you know a good effort first half, just saved, and um, so yeah, it was, a, it was a crucial save for us. I think other than that. You know, although they put pressure on us, Cammy's not had any direct saves, whereas their goal has had a lot to do. So um, we take confidence and belief yet again into uh, Wednesday night. With just two short days to kind of recoup and rehabilitate, how difficult and how much do you think that's going to have taken the, out of the side? Well, only Wednesday we'll, we'll see on Wednesday. Um, it's a, I don't know how this will play out in the fact that, you know, Hibs have not played for 18 days. They're certainly going to the, the time back a good form. Likewise, we do. You know, we, we've had some fantastic results and played in patches some good stuff. Um, I think the good thing is I don't think we've got many injuries or any injuries. So we'll just have to freshen them up. But I said, it's, we know what the carrot is. So tiredness won't come into it mentally or physically. We know what job's required. Um, and it doesn't have to be done on Wednesday. You know, we, we, we had, you know, last time we were at Hibs, we won there. So um, great games to look forward to. And just lastly, now that you know your old side mother well, you're going to be meeting them in the final if you get that far. Does that make things different to you? Does it make it a bit more difficult? No, all I would say on that is that I'm really surprised and very disappointed that they finished 11th. Um, but that won't even come to me thinking. Hibs first and foremost. And then, you know, if we get through, then we'll look at that. But, um, you know, we'll just look to Wednesday.